I believe the role of Abigail and um, she's a young woman and she's traveling um, and she gets into a small accident she has an issue with her car and so she's stuck in this town until she can get her car fixed and while there she um, uncovers a mystery that she tries to solve and she's mysteriously getting sicker and sicker and it, it doesn't have to do with the it does that have to do the mystery that she's solving what's happening and uh, she has to figure it out before time runs out we need it for this shot for this shot this is my third feature. Uh, typically I dabble in drama or romances, sometimes uh, some comedy, but this is a mystery thriller, a little bit of horror, uh, so it's a new genre for me. Well, there's not too many films made in Indiana. Uh, since I grew up here, I, I love to bring my work down here. The state is slowly growing. I think we have like three to four features shot here a year, little low budget indies. It's a great environment to work in. Everyone's so friendly no matter where you go in the state. Muncie's been great to us. Move. I'd heard of Muncie before from, I have a few friends who went to Ball State and they speak very highly of Muncie and then also the TV show Parks and Recreation is one of my favorite shows and one of the characters' favorite place in the world to visit is Muncie, Indiana. It, well, this is my first feature length film. It is a different genre for me as well as John. I haven't done a thriller or suspense before, mostly romance and drama. And speaking of first times, I learned how to drive stick for this movie. I drive a pretty neat uh, Ford Falcon, which was very exciting. <laughs>